A few minutes of high-intensity exercise can prevent liver disease. That, according to a report at studyfinds.org. Before you start boozing it up, study authors say that getting in that daily workout can help people dealing with non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. Researchers from Western Sydney University add that not only does moderate intensity continuous training, or MICT, improve your liver health, Shorter and more intense workouts, high-intensity interval training, or HIIT, HIT, work just as well. Non-alcoholic fatty liver disease is one of the most common liver diseases in the world, affecting up to 3 in 10 people. Patients experience an excess buildup of fat in the liver without drinking much alcohol. Scientists reviewed over 28,000 previous studies on the link between exercise and liver health, focusing specifically on 19 that involved 745 people. Moreover, these studies examined liver fat levels using the current gold standard in non-invasive measurement techniques such as proton magnetic resonance spectroscopy and magnetic resonance imaging. For people engaging in MICT, their liver fat levels dropped by 3.14%, while people participating in HIT saw their fat levels drop by 2.85%. Researchers note that the results point to people at risk for liver disease being able to improve their health without the need for long and draining workout sessions. Previous studies show that HIT can also improve heart function and accomplishes what normal exercise does in a fraction of the time. Lead author and NICM Health Research Institute postdoctoral research fellow Dr. Angela Sabag said, quote, Another interesting finding was that even if people didn't exercise at volume sufficient to satisfy the recommended physical activity guidelines, they could still achieve clinically significant improvements in liver fat so long as they exercised regularly above a moderate intensity. Find more on this and other studies at studyfinds.org.